and Buckley. Hedges gets to the edge of the box, no. looks into the middle, he's unmarked at the back post, Brereton Diaz. And he's absolutely skied that. You would have bet your house on him finding at least the target from there, a player of that quality. He ran into a bit of trouble with a bit of help from Rakin Costello in the end. This is a good period. Yeah, just saying, if you, if you go indiscriminately as individuals, you, you get picked off and played through. Then you're expansive and you'll get hurt. Go on, Anton. It's a nice ball down the Cut right back. side of the box. Semenyo looking for options oh. in the middle and not far it. away from finding one as well. Wells, I think, did get the touch on that. It's gone behind for a goal kick. And that is as close as Bristol City have come so far. A nice disguised ball play down the outside of Semenyo. Looked up, saw the run of Wells. You can always trust that he's going to be getting into a goal-scoring position. City just leaving Viner back, and even he is well inside the Blackburn half. James lifts it in towards oh, the middle. Semenyo loses out in the uh, battle of the first men. It's back into the middle ball. again. Oh. Big save from, Kamin from uh, Kaminsky. What a save then that was. Before City can recycle the ball. The referee has blown for a foul, so I'm not sure if that <coughs> had gone in, whether it would have counted. We'll have a look and see what the discrepancy was that uh, Tim Robinson noted there. Let's have a look at what happened from that effort. It was a glancing header, I think, from Naki Wells from James's second delivery. Here's Naismith. Lovely looking ball and Semenya gets something oh, on it. Oh, wow. <laughs> Referee says he had the final touch and Naismith's got that in his locker sometimes, hasn't he? Those he, lovely balls from yeah, deep that... He, he can whip them in. He really, whips them in with pace. It must really catch a defender yeah. unaware as well because it was so difficult to defend against. Yeah. And Naki Wells blocks his path eventually. He's over the halfway line. Morton again. Messy, isn't it? Just don't really think anyone knew where that was going for him. And there were a lot of turned heads. And eventually it's Dak who does put his foot on it. And now there's Morton in the area. Dak is unmarked and puts Blackburn ahead. He was the one switched on in midfield. And he's the one who puts Blackburn in front. And goes off to celebrate with the fans behind the Atio stand. Bristol City just caught napping there defensively. That's where they've cut us open now. We've all got drawn in and we've, he's just delayed his running. It's Blackburn who strike first here at Ashton Gate. And work now to do for Bristol City. We've been talking about what would happen if City scored first. Well, it's Blackburn who have taken the lead, but they might be pegged back straight away here. Semenyo! Yeah. Oh. Side netting only as close as City have come for some time and what a perfect opportunity that would have been. I thought that was in. I don't think you were the only one. Atkinson is a lovely ball through, good take from Semenyo. It's cross field. And Semenyo will bring it down, it's another great touch. From the Ghanaian international trying to open up space for a shot and in the end tried to find James but uh, it was well read by Buckley. Burn still keep the press on. struggling to get out of their own half though. There's Wells on the turn. Ooh. And there goes another Bristol City shout for a penalty, which is unanswered by referee Tim Robinson. It's tackled him on the wrong side, it look. Let's just see have Bristol City lost out here. It's a good play from Naismith at first, squares it for Wells, and you've got to say it looks like it goes through the back of them there. He's rolled him, money. He's semi-rolled him. Be, you know, and, and be brave. You've got to try things. You've got to be, ex you've got to experiment, and it might not always come off. But you've got to do the unpredictable thing to break break a block down. Tanner just about keeps it in. Managed to get the cross in as well, and it's still not cleared here. Well played by Sykes. Good persistence, and then an almighty mess almost from Scott Wharton. Fell on the ball after trying to clear it, and he's lucky that Kaminsky's the man who ends up picking it up rather than Naki Wells. Need a response now. Smith over this corner. It's floated in. Oh, Semenyo's uh, on almost with some problems for Blackburn. There's still maybe City coming again with Viner. Oh, Showing some good composure to get away from Vale. He's still going here, Viner. And the rebound. Yeah! 
Palace is turned in by Semenyo. Bristol City are level. It's a bit of a goalkeeping howler, but City won't care one jot. Viner's shot spilled at the feet of Antoine Semenyo. And he nets his sixth goal of the season for the home side to bring them level. Great from Zach Viner stepping out there with the ball. Lovely touch, but yeah. let's take away from his man. Yeah, he's taken the man on, got a shot on target. If you don't buy a ticket, you'll never win the draw. He's done well here, then he stepped in. Really good play from Semenya yeah. as well, just the one for O'Leary. Here's James. Oh, well done, Naku. Naku does well and does win the free kick. Naku's done very well there. And Ayala is here, who's already been shown a yellow card, and the red one is out from Tim Robinson. And we mentioned it before half-time, both centre-backs on yellow cards, and up against a man as tricky as Naki Wells, you're always running a bit of a fine line there. Naki's done superb there. He's just halted his run, which brought Ayala onto his back, and um, basically fouled him. He's brought the foul. That's a little intricate play by Pring, and this is good from City. Slowly getting their way forward. Inside to James, dropping a little bit deeper. Viner forward. Naismith, lovely touch from Scott. Not the first we've seen from him today, and a nice take from Bell as well. Now it's into the middle from Tanner. Brought down by Semenyo. Scott shot blocked behind for a corner. Is Naismith. James takes over, making the pitch wide here with Tanner. Naismith again gets past Dak, plays it into the box towards Bell. Yeah! Here's the chance, and surely the winner! Yeah! Oh, offside. The flag is up. Oh. oh, heartbreak for young Sam Bell. The late hero at Swansea on Tuesday, and just for a moment, looked like he would be here as well.